Hey, how are you, everybody? Thank you. It is indeed a pleasure for me to be here. I am the interim chancellor of the University of Arkansas. My name is Charles Robinson. One attend class. You say, boy, that's really profound, Dr. Robinson. Uh, it, it's not that profound, but it's extraordinarily important. You will have the temptation of not going to class because sometimes, you know, you might have had a late night the night before and you just might think, well, I can miss this. No, go to class. And when you go to class, sit towards the front of the classroom. Why do you want to sit towards the front of the classroom? So you can write, you, you can be seen by the faculty member. Why is it important to be seen by the faculty member? Yes, they'll know you're there. They think you care. And even if you don't care, you can pretend to care, right? Uh, but you do care. I'm, I, I, I was trying to make a joke. Y'all didn't laugh. That's good. Uh, you, you, you do care. You do care. And you want to convey that you care about your classes. So that's really important. N number two, I think it's extraordinarily important for each and every one of you to seek out help when you run into real, some problems. You know, the, the, there's a tendency to say, well, I can do it myself, right? And there are things you can manage yourself, but you should always seek out help. You can find staff and, and faculty members who will help you. And so look for that support. You have free tutorial services here at the University of Arkansas. Look for that support. Don't be ashamed to do that and do it early. If you run into any problem, let people know you have that challenge so that they can help you. If you sit on it, it festers and gets worse. That's usually not a good thing. Num number three, visit the faculty members in their offices. I know it, I know you say, well really? Yeah, go by, get to know their office hours. Go visit. What do you say? Well, what do you say when you get there? Because that's what students say. Well, what do I say when I get there? What if I'm doing just fine? You go there and you say, hey, hello, my name is Charles Robinson. And I just want to let you know how much I enjoy your class. And y'all looking at me like, hey, what if I don't enjoy it? Well, well, at least go and express that you are interested in the classroom. Again, this conveys that you are a serious student and that will matter because remember, faculty members are human beings and how they feel does affect how they respond to you, right? And plus, you're building relationship. And that takes me to number four, and that is network. You need to network. Don't, don't be satisfied with just going to class and going home. Join organizations. How many of you joined a registered student organization already? Okay, we've got some work to do here. You need to join an organization. Join something that you're interested in or create an organization, which you can, but join, you have to join. If you join, you connect. One of the things that happens to students, particularly those who come from small communities, they come to the University of Arkansas and they're like, my goodness, there's there a lot of people here. There are a lot of people, you know, this is the largest class we've ever had in the history of the University of Arkansas. It will be over 7,000 students in this class. Our total enrollment, I was told yesterday, went over 30,000 for the first time. We were at 29,000 last year, we're at over 30 and counting. We might be at 31,000 people. You have got to connect deliberately so you don't feel lost. And when you feel lost, you don't want to stay in a place where you feel lost. Connect with people, get to know them, get involved. Plus you build your leadership skills and your network. And then the last thing, very, very important. Remember, this is a marathon, not a sprint. You're gonna have good days and then you have days that are not so good. Don't respond, over respond to the day. Remember, Stay balanced, stay balanced. This is going to be a long run. And if you develop the ability to pace yourself and do things and handle the good and the not so good, 
you'll find that you can stay here and be successful to the end. Each and every single one of you can graduate.